which of the following relations are functions? Now, before I answer that question, or before we answer that question, um, I just want to note that there are four ways to represent a function. Okay? One way is to represent a function as a set of ordered pairs, which is this one right here. We can also represent a function as, as a graph, as a mapping, and also as an equation, which will be discussed in the next videos. Okay, so, so how do you identify or how do you determine whether a set of ordered pairs represents a function? Madali lang, okay? Very simple. You just need, need to look at the first values in your set of ordered pairs, okay? So you consider every pair, you look at the first values. So for this pair, let's consider example A. So look at the pairs, look at the first values, okay? So tingnan mo mga first values ng pairs. And make sure na walang nag-ulit na number, okay? Dapat walang number na uh, uh, uulit sa first entries, okay? Kung walang nag-ulit na numbers, that means that is a function. But if my number na nag-ulit, that is not a function. Okay? So it's clear for this example, since walang number na nag-ulit, 1 only occurred once, 2 only occurred once, 3 only occurred once, and 4 only occurred once, that means that we have a function right here. Okay? So this is a function. Now, let's look at the second example. So we have 1, 3, 1, 4, 2, 5, 2, 6, 3, 7. Let's look at the first values. Tingnan natin. So, you have 1, and then you have 1. So, dito pa lang, alam mo na, hindi na siya function. Okay? Kasi may number na nag-ulit. Okay? Itong 1, nag-ulit siya. And remember, you only have to consider the first number, right? Hindi mo kailangan ito i-consider. Hindi mo kailangan tingnan ang second number. Ito lang first numbers ang kailangan mo tingnan. Okay? So, dito pa lang, 1 at saka 1, you already know na hindi ito function. Okay? So, hindi mo na kailangan mag-proceed. Hindi mo kailangan tingnan itong mga next values. Kasi dito pa lang, sa dalawang pairs na ito, dito pa lang, eh, alam mo na, hindi, hindi siya function. Okay? So, this is not a function. Alright. Now, let's proceed to the third example. H is the set 1, 3, 2, 6, 3, 9, and so on. And this thing right here, kind of weird. Okay, pero ang ibig sabihin nito, this is the pattern of, of the ordered pair. Okay? So, N uh, means natural numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and so on. So, here, 1. Your, here, your N is 1, right? So, tingnan natin. So, here, your N is 1. And then, your partner is 3 because 3 times 1 is 3. Okay? Uh, here, you have 2. Your n is 2. Uh, your partner is 6 because 3 times 2 is 6. Okay? Here, you have 3. And then, you have 9 because 3 times 3 is 9. And uh, continuing this pattern, you will know that the next pair would be 4 and 12. Because if, you're, if, you're, if your n is 4, if your n is 4, then 3 times 4, 3 times 4, gives you 4 and 12. So the next number, or the next pair is 4 and 12. And the next pair after that is 5 and 15, and so on. Okay? Now the question is, does this represent, does this represent a function? Okay? So, tingnan natin. So you look at the first entries. You have 1. Here you have 2. Here you have 3. And then again, as I've said, the next number is 4, right? The next number, the next pair is 4, 12. And then the next pair after that is 5, 15. And the next number will be 6 and 18 and so on. So, so remember, you only have to consider the first entries, the first numbers. And since you know na itong mga numbers na ito, eh, hindi na uulit, right? Ang sunod ng 5 is 6, ang sunod ng 6 is 7, sunod ng 7 is 8. So, walang number, walang first entry ang uulit. And so, therefore, this right here is a function. Okay? Function yan siya. Because, you know, your first entry, first number ng pairs, ay hindi uulit. Alam mo, because you know what the pattern is. Okay? So even though it extends until infinity, right? That means you extend 
um, the 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 sequence of of pairs to infinity doesn't matter because you know na wala talagang number na uulit. So that's how you know that this set of ordered pairs represent a function. So ganun lang. See you in the next video.